CBP agents reported an MS-13 gang member used a toddler with chicken pox in an attempt to make a fraudulent migrant family claim. One America's Emily Finn explains. Border protection officials care for a child with chicken pox brought to the U.S.-Mexico border as part of a fake migrant family. In a recent tweet, Customs and Border Protection posted a blurred out picture of the child in the arms of a Border Patrol agent. The agency says, quote, the male who the child was with is not related to the child and has ties to the MS-13 gang. Child smuggling in hopes of a quicker release for migrants seeking to enter the U.S. has been a rising problem for Border Patrol agents. In April, Homeland Security Investigation Special Agents say they found evidence of fraud in more than 25 percent of family unit claims. Adults are attempting to cross the border with a child who is not related to them because asylum seekers traveling with children can only be detained for short periods of time. And the inability to keep families together while they complete expeditious and fair immigration proceedings. Instead, crossing with a child is a near guarantee of a speedy release. The smugglers are choosing the timing and location for these crossings strategically in order to disrupt our border security efforts, create a diversion for smuggling of narcotics, and allow single adults seeking to evade capture to sneak in. In an effort to combat the surge of migrants at the southern border, the CBP is now testing out a rapid DNA program to speed up the process to uncover fraudulent families. But migrants are attempting to enter the U.S. illegally at higher rates than border protection agents can keep up with. I had a gentleman in Guatemala last week tell me that everybody knows that bringing a child is a passport for migration right now. Uh, and, and so we have to take additional measures at the border, and we've done that. We have HSI teams now, about 500 uh, special agents working this issue nationally, 140 on the border. Even with record-breaking apprehensions at the southern border, migrants continue to find loopholes in the system like smuggling children as part of fake families to illegally sneak their way into the U.S. Emily Finn, One America News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.